वेलकम टू माई YouTube चैनल मैकेनिकल मैजिक मैकेनिकल लर्निंग ट्यूटोरियल्स टूडे इन दिस वीडियो आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट सम ऑफ द इम्पोर्टेंस मशीनिंग एलिमेंट्स विच कैन बी यूज इन टू द मिलिंग मशीन फॉर मैन्युफैक्चरिंग ऑफ ए गियर सो हियर द इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक फॉर द मैन्युफैक्चरिंग प्रोसेस वन और कैन से प्रोडक्शन टेक्नोलॉजी इंडेक्सिंग मैकेनिज्म ऑन अ मिलिंग मशीन सो बेसिकली इंडेक्सिंग मैकेनिज्म इज विल बी यूज for the operation of the dividing the periphery of the work into any number of equal part suppose i have a one gear blank and i need to make an gear like this so i need to dividing all the periphery into equal number of parts so that will be the important theory indexing mechanism is being used for dividing the periphery of a gear blank into require equal number of parts so let us see the construction of a dividing head over here so just you can see over here so in that case here it will be the index plate is being used on to the indexing head so that index plate it will be attached with an index crank so crank is being rotated and that will be connected with the index plate with the application of index pin so over here just you can see that index crank is connected with the worm and worm wheel over here so that worm it will be rotating by a uh, index crank and so that rotation of an index plate so this worm is also is being rotating like this so that will be connected with the worm wheel so worm wheel is being rotated like this so according to the rotation of an index plate with the attachment with the index pin so that rotation it will be converting with the application of worm and worm wheel with the spindle and here it will be the one of the center it will be having a gear blank so that gear blank it will be rotated so generally in case of an indexing mechanism what happen by the rotation of this index plate that will be having a rotations so in the simple indexing 40 rotations are required to complete one single rotation so simple for the any indexing mechanisms over here 40 rotation of an index plate index plate that should be equal to one rotation of gear blank so that will be the simple relation of an indexing mechanism which will be used on to the milling machines so let us see over here the index plate of the dividing head consists of a number of holes with the crank pin from that figure we can see that the index crank drives the spindle and live center through a worm and worm gear generally it will be having a 40 teeth we we already discuss so as a result a full rotation of a work piece is produced by the full revolution of an index crank so further indexing is made possible by the having of the index plate with the equi space holes around the various centers so that will be having a different index plate is being used for the indexing mechanisms or dividing the periphery of an gear blank into equal number of parts so let us see over here the two standard plates are available for the production of an gears so here starting with the first one the index plate with available with brown and sharp milling machines so in that case the this system having a three different plate numbers 
and all the plate numbers having a different hall systems. So let us see for the plate number 1 that will be indication or you can say the number of whole circle systems are you can find when that will be the 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 and 20 whole circle systems onto the index plate and plate number 2 that will be having a 21, 23, 27, 29, 31 and 33 whole circle systems and plate number 3 of same brown and sharp systems that will be 37, 39, 41, 43, 47 and 49 systems. So suppose that will be available of the brown and sharp system. So you can use any one of these plate according to my requirement of the index number. So the second systems index plate used for the Cincinnati and you can say Parkinson dividing head. So in that case of the Cincinnati or you can say Parkinson dividing head. So that will be having a plate number one. But the plate number one that will be having a two different sides. So plate number 1 for the side 1, it will be having a 24, 25, 28, 30, 34, 37, 38, 39, 41, 42 and 43 whole circle system. Now for the side number 2 for the plate number 1 for the Cincinnati and Parkinson dividing head. So side number 2 having a 46, 47, 49, 51, 53, 57, 58, 59, 62 and 66 whole circle system. So by the application of indexing mechanism and a different kind of index plate available into the workshop, we can use any of the combination of the plate number 1, 2 and 3 from the brown and sharp system or you can use the plate number 1 for the side 1 and side 2 for the Cincinnati and Parkinson dividing head to dividing the periphery into equal number of parts. So if you like this then subscribe, share, thank you very much.